In this tutorial, we create another free point and show that we can move it separately from the free point we created in the previous tutorial. In our previous tutorials, we turned on the grid and we created a free point A and we moved the free point A. Now let's make another new point. To make another new point, we have to go back to the new point tool. Click to activate it. In your window, it will say point over here. Because I'm working in such a small window, there's not enough space, so it doesn't want to write that. Let's make a new point at 1, 2. So we get to 1, 2 and click. There it is, 1, 2. And notice it's blue because it is also a free object. These two objects are not dependent on each other. So we can move them separately. If you want to move them, though, remember to go to the Move tool and then Move. Click it and drag it. And notice A doesn't move. A is independent of B. So here we've created and moved another free point, B.